Researchers in Virginia Tech's College of Engineering are working on a project for the U.S. Navy that could one day put lifelike autonomous robot jellyfish in waters around the world. The first step is to understand the fundamentals of propulsion mechanisms utilized by nature. You know, we're dealing with a type of propulsion that's not commonly studied. Uh, it's not like a boat or a, a submarine, um, you know, where we have flexible parts, we've got a lot of parts moving. There's a lot of challenges. Um, first of all, you know, we're dealing with a lot of electronics. We're going to make sure that the electronics don't get wet when they go in the water. Our goal with this robot is to copy the natural jellyfish. The artificial mesoglia sits on top of a mechanical system, uh, which consists of eight arms, and they're all actuated by linear actuators, which are controlled by uh, electronics. The artificial mesoglia is, is basically a big blob of silicone. We use the same type of silicone that's used for making uh, masks that you see in movies and things like that. Um, it's very soft, which mimics the same mechanical properties as the natural animal. And, and basically, that's the, the jelly of the jellyfish. This robot, we intend to leave it in the ocean for as long as we can. So we're talking like weeks and months and even more if we can. We need to have something that's very efficient and can make the, the energy that we have stored on board lasts as long as possible. In the future, a robot jellyfish's job could include conducting military surveillance, cleaning oil spills, or monitoring the environment.